Ni hao, wa shi yi. Today's video is for Chinese learners who experience these situations. You finally can pronounce photos. Say the first word. Di. Good. Not a second word. Tu. But once a phrase over two syllables or a sentence comes to you, sense start losing control. Now say both together. Di tu. One day you got an opportunity to talk to Chinese people. You're so excited to use a fancy word or a grammar structure which you spent a long time to learn. But it seems they have a problem understand you. How much longer do I need to learn Chinese? I think sentence pronunciation is impossible. I'll just give up and say whatever it sounds correct. All these situations are very natural results if you don't get sentence pronunciation training and so far the most important technique to train sentence pronunciation is tongue pair in this video you will understand that why tongue pair is the most important drill for you and you will also know how to use tongue pair to pronounce tones properly in a sentence because you happen to like my video for Chinese kids, before learning PE in primary school, most of us will speak a dialect with our parents or friends first, which already contain tones. Like, for example, like my dialogue is Chang De Hua. The Mandarin is See, you can notice that even though the tones are not exactly the same, you still can feel the tones are flowing in a sentence. And also, I can't speak a random tone to my local friends, otherwise they'll look at me. The pressure you might experience. So luckily, we already have the ability to make tones flow properly in a sentence when we were very little. Later on, we go to school to learn standard Mandarin. Once we are taught the four tones, we can pronounce tones properly in a sentence immediately. Then look at you. If your mother language doesn't have tones, or it has tones, but the tones don't make the meaning different, especially your mother language is English, the pitch of words in a sentence are quite average. You just don't get used to making the tones up or down. Even though it took you a long time to figure out what the full tones sound like, it is not surprising that you still can't pronounce tones properly in a sentence. So compared to Chinese people, what are you missing? A Chinese dialect? Of course not. Just kidding. I mean, the ability to make tones flow properly in a sentence. And the tone pair is the most efficient and important drill for you to build this ability. It's like a bridge. It helps you move from this tone to the next tone smoothly. Let's do the tone pair drills now. But before that, make sure you already mastered every single tone first. If not, watch my last video about the four tones before proceeding this video. High tone plus high tone. Cafe, cafe, your turn. Jin tian, jin tian, your turn. Xi gua, xi gua, your turn. Wo. 先吃,先吃,西瓜 Combine them. 我先吃西瓜 喝杯,喝杯,咖啡 Combine them. 喝杯咖啡。我先吃西瓜，喝杯咖啡。Falling tone plus falling tone. 
about this tone pair, I want to loosen carefully to feel how do I pronounce it. 再见，再见。但是，但是，睡觉，睡觉。I pronounce the first falling tone from the top. But when I do the second falling tone, I didn't do the exactly the same thing. It starts from a lower level and then drops. 再见，再见。Not 再见 ，or 再见。上课，上课。Your turn. 教室，教室。Your turn. 睡觉。睡觉 ，your turn. Okay, I combine it now. 我，我，在，在，教室，上课，上课。我在教室上课。我在教室上课。今天，今天，太热，太热，了，了，今天太热了，今天太热了，医生，医生。太快，太快，了，了，医生太快了，医生太快了。In the process of practicing Chinese sentence with twenty tone pairs, you will notice that those messy tones. Start behaving well and slowly light up in your mouth, and eventually come up as you expected. Tell me in the comments if you want me to make another video about the rest of the tone pairs. So that's all for today. Do you like me? Subscribe to my channel, and you will never miss my other videos.